I'm a traditional bowl turner. I make wooden bowls on a foot-powered lathe. When I started, there was nobody in the UK using this kind of traditional lathe. And when I saw that, that lathe in the museum, I thought that's a, a real shame that that skill has died out. Um, and I wanted to recreate it, to learn the skill. Um, so it wasn't easy, I had no one to teach me, but I could see the photographs of the old man who had used to do the craft. And I saw the tools and the lathe, and then very slowly, slowly, over six or seven years, I learned to do the craft. I was a forester before I was a craftsperson. I worked in forestry, uh, managing trees with a chainsaw. And so I'm very conscious of the fact that wood is, uh, is carbon neutral. And if I, if I make a bowl from wood and people love that bowl and they form a relationship with it. Now, people will eat from that bowl every day for 20 years um, and they treasure it. So um, it's reducing people's environmental footprint on the world. I think in the, the modern world, um, particularly as the world becomes more digital, many people are spending all their lives looking at screens and um, in some ways some of modern life is is very bad we're trashing the planet and there's a lot of bad things that are happening but we shouldn't look at the past and say oh it was always better we there are some things when we can look at the past and inspire new things for the future so working with wood even if it's just uh, for half an hour or an hour in the evening, carving a spoon can really help people reconnect with something tangible. It's part of what makes us human, I think. I've maybe, probably, uh, I've turned between 25 and, and 30,000 bowls in my life, and all of those bowls are out there on people's tables being used every day and that's I think that is probably the most meaningful thing to me in my bowl turning work. People will often write me letters or emails and say um, you know I've eaten my breakfast every day from one of your bowls for 15 years and it, it adds a little pleasure every day and and to me then that's very meaningful for me. Uh, I think it's a wonderful thing for a tree to end up um, as a bowl like that, that has that extra life going on.